So I used an app, and right there at the edge of that roof and the top of that other roof, that's where the sun's at. And so I've seen this method online. Other people have posted. I also kind of came up with it on my own before I saw other people using it. And I was deceived as well, but I wanted to explain why I believe it, the Iceland Spar, the Sunstone, cannot be used with this method. Now, there are other methods, putting a dot, I believe that would work. I haven't fully tested all of those out, but this method, I'm convinced, would not be used for navigation. I'm gonna show why. So this edge, based on other videos I've seen and videos that I've made, would indicate the direction of the sun. If you turn this and you get the other edge around, you notice how this line becomes solid and that one becomes double. Again, saying that the sun is in that direction. So if I turn this around, you can see that this one went double, this one went single. Again, indicating that the sun should be in that direction. But what I really think is happening, which I know is happening, is that's just the du double refraction of the Iceland Spar. It has nothing to do with the direction of the sun. Because if it had something to do with the direction of the sun, that line would change as I turn this whole platform without moving the Iceland Spar. I'm moving everything together. You notice there's no change. It has nothing to do with the direction of the sun this is all double refraction of the Iceland Spar. And as far as I know, you wouldn't be able to use that for navigation. So I just wanted to post that video out there because there are some online where they fail to move the base and they're just turning the Iceland Spar. Again, I was deceived as well before I went out and tried to test this for navigation. And then I noticed as I turned the base, there was no change in those lines. So right now, um, like I said, I can change this. That change of the lines is just double refraction. It has nothing to do with the direction of the sun relative to the crystal. I just want to put that out there in case somebody else watches a video it won't be confused, but I do believe the other methods where you put a dot at the end of the crystal and you look through, I do believe that could be used to find at least the direction of the sun, the location of the sun, and then that could be used with other methods for navigation.